Give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. It's gonna go fine, right, Cruz? Easy is really worse. Sacknarth ain't never heard of roads? You'd have to clear parts of the jungle to do it, which would probably They deserve it. Sacknarth 9 is a sanctuary. They say that if you leave behind a single piece of refuse, Lady Hellbender will personally return it to you. Ha! <laughs> Deep freeze. Whoa! Can I try ice cubing something? Nope. Man, you're such a So if we're gonna haggle with the monster queen, how much are we asking for our monster? What do you mean, don't get greedy? We need to make a profit this time. Hey, well, better not forget what we talked about earlier. Don't worry, Rocket. Whoa, that is definitely in my top ten fortresses. Wasted our time. Almost got killed for nothing. And got arrested. It was moderately amusing. Now we've got a ticking time bomb on the ship, and we owe money to the cops. All because of one lousy source. Guys, every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet. Say that again? What if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here only to find out Lady H already had a full set? Exactly. If we even got that far, what if we've been towing that thing when Nova Corps intercepted us? See? This is working out. You can't be serious. Okay. Farther than it looked. Much farther. That's a flock in infinity bridge, is what it is. Are uh, you being dramatic, Rodent? Bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Three cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you good? Oh! Right! The cage. The point of even getting the Flarkin thing is looking like we mean business. Group, you ready to squeeze in? I am. Peter Quill, there's still time to reconsider. The tree creature is not very monstrous. Drax, we're doing this just like we planned on the Milano. You're being stubborn. Clearly the rodent is I the one that... I am not being stubborn. I just refuse to change my mind. B because it's the right decision. Hey, lovebirds, let's go. Bridge ain't gonna cross itself. 
I hope Lady Hellbender is as gullible as you expect she is. You hang tight there, bud. When the time comes, I'll get you out of there. Rocket style if I gotta. Drat. Gamora, can you help me with this? No. What? Why? To guarantee your safety as her leader. Ah, oh, come on. Uh, don't look at me. I ain't pulling that thing. Remember, buddy, menacing like me, only uh, bigger. I am good. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, here we go. You heard, but we just want to bring you back a new friend. I know it can't understand me, but maybe it responds good to soothing tones. <sighs> Does anybody have like a campfire song or something we can sing to kill the time? Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called. Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is. Please stop the name of your song. No. Okay. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2.1. 0 0.3 clicks. 4.5. 0 0.4 clicks. 0 0.5 0 .5 clicks. clicks. 0 0.6 clicks. clicks. For the love, love of Lark, stop, stop counting, counting clicks. We could enumerate all the ways in which our class like like there. Quietly. Hey, birthday boy. I wonder if you can hear me. Star Lord. The guy with the scary eyes. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. Be warm enough to spend the night in the yard soon. I love falling asleep looking at the stars, wondering what might be out there. Andy says you can get a brain parasite if you share a toothbrush. Imagine that, something growing inside of you, slowly taking over. Well, 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 look who decided to finally come up. Where's my cake? I warned you. <laughs> no, you didn't. I am so full. Mom. Oh. Okay, sit your butt down, slowpoke. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I like your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look at all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. On. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, 
What huge favor are you about to ask me? Just 10 bucks. Dan, Andy, and I want to go see Night of the Cosmos at the Real tonight. A movie? Tonight. Come on. It's gonna be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. I don't think I'd want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. That was ages ago. And this one isn't even that bad. It's PG-13. And I'm 13. Exactly. PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff. Or some of it. Tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house, and you know it. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was- I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about. Something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. Dare touch that dial. Shoot, Mom told me to put the
was saying, you don't trust me, Rocket? With proof? Clark, no. I ain't putting his part solely in your hands. Your call, Peter. This jealous my plan's better. You're green with envy. Try it, lady. I got 12,000 volts with your name on it. Could really use a voice of reason here, Peter. I'm sure you can trust Gamora with that thing that I was definitely paying attention to. I trust her with my life. I'd trust her with your life, too. Just not with Groot's. Okay, mean. I've got a lot more experience no sneaking into places than coming. you do. I still say me and my tracking device serious? would have better odds of Just finding it. Not without sounding doubts. every alarm in the process. Lame. definitely paying attention to. I trust her with my life. I'd trust her with your life, too. Just not with Groot's. Okay, mean. I've got a lot more experience sneaking into places than you do. I still say me and my tracking device would have better odds of finding him. Not without sounding every alarm in the process. <sighs> and you've Look been outvoted. what we've got coming. Uh, are they serious? Guess we're going to find out. Lane. Guardians of the Galaxy. Never heard of you. Well, you do live on a mud ball in the middle of nowhere. What's that? What he means is, you will have. We're huge in the Kree system. What's in the box? A rare creature, last of his kind, and all-around swell guy. Looks like a bush. It is a tree. A talking tree. That's new. All right, get going. Before I change my mind. And if the lady don't like it, I'll be cutting up what's left of you in that box. Thanks, officer. Have a nice day. Officer? Whatever. Not exactly an easy way out if this all goes to hell. It's gonna go great. We got a killer monster and a solid plan. The tree is no killer. We should be selling the angry rodent. Lady Hellbender will be displeased. What? I'm supposed to be scared just because she's got hell in her name? She runs a glorified zoo. That's no zoo. It's a flarkin' army. Any chance they're the zookeepers? With guns? I have never seen Orthos tamed. But I have seen one trample a man to pulp. It's fine. Worst comes to worst, we hightail it for the Milano. Unless she's got a fleet of Shi'ar dropships. Yeah, like she's got a bunch of ships to take her old monster mash on tour. No I stand corrected. Those ain't Shi'ar. Oh, come on. Why did we not simply dock here and avoid the planet's inhospitable surface? Great question. Next time, I'm flying. Indeed. We needed time to iron out the plan. Now it's foolproof. Lady Hellbender is no fool. When her monster goes missing, she'll assume it was us. Assume, yes, but not no. Not chases across the galaxy level of no, at least. Are you flarkin' kidding me? Look at this place! How's Gamora supposed to find Groot once we've sold him? I'll find someone who knows and listen. You're gonna ask for directions? Never said I'd ask. Screw this. I'm not gonna let you just wing it with Groot. Rocket's got a point. Thanks! No one's more sneaky or badass, Gamora, but this place is a maze. So give me your stupid tracker thing! No flarkin' way! A Galeran skull. That is truly a priceless trophy. Behold! 
woman with expensive tastes. That's good news for our deal. Come on, we're a team. We stick together. All for one and one for all. That's surprisingly insightful. Did you just make that up? Uh, yep, just now. Totally off the top of my head. Follow me and pay attention. You will not approach Lady Hellbender's throne. If she chooses to approach you, you will remain still. No erratic movements. I am humbled by my queen's confidence. Spare me your empty platitudes. Apologies, my queen. I meant no offense. I know what you meant. Do not claim me for your fool. You are not the first to claim they have captured a Tara Tara. Uh, you, you doubt its authenticity? If it is what you say it is, prove it. Or suffer the consequence of every other would-be con artist. I assure you, I said, milady. release it. We got this. Bring in the next seller, and transfer 10,000 units to that last one's next of kin. Speak. Hey there, I'm Star-Lord. Okay. Drax the Destroyer. <laughs> the undoing of the Mad Titan in the flesh. And... Such flesh. Your presence honors me. You are much smaller than I expected. Oh? <laughs> and what were you expecting? Perhaps I can do something about it. But uh, unlikely. We'll see, Destroyer. I can be quite forceful. Peter Quill. I believe she is flirting with me. Don't worry, man, I got this. Women love me. Hey there, hi, uh... I'm Star-Lord. Drax is actually with me, the leader of the Guardians of the Galaxy. You may have heard of us. You? No. Oh, well, let me tell you. Now you have. <sighs> Lucky me. What do you want? Drax, buddy. Show her. Show her what? The monster, man. Open the cage, show her the monster. You should have said that. A flora colossus. I thought your kind had been wiped out. 
So you're interested then? Four thousand units. What? Four thousand units? Are you freaking kidding me? Groot is worth way more than four thousand units. Tell her, Quill. Tell Lady Nutjob we ain't selling Groot for less than eight. Lady Nutjob? We've got other offers. Like the Collector, for one. He's willing to pay ten thousand units. Floorboard, was it? Star-Lord. Seknarf-9 might seem like a savage backwater planet to you, but I have eyes and ears everywhere. If Tivan made an offer on a Flora Colossus, I would have heard. Since I heard nothing, it's clear you're lying. More like bluffing. And not very well. Agreed. Peter Quill's negotiation skills are terrible. Uh, uh, Drax, buddy, you've got a good eye for monsters. What do you think a good price is for Groot? Well, the creature is a capable warrior, is loyal, and he possesses regenerative qualities. And he's the best pal a guy could wish for. She will serve you well, Lady Hellbender. 12,000 units would be sufficient. 10,500. But only because I like you, Destroyer. That amount would also be acceptable. The storms of Seknoff grow ravenous. You will stay among my Hellraisers and revel as one of us. Yeah, this is great. We'd be... Thank you. You were flirting with a Sicknarfian beast handler. Who confirmed that Groot is definitely probably being kept in the new additions pen. Which is where exactly? Well, we didn't quite get that far. Good thing we're doing my plan. Tracker's pointing back to Lady Skull Suit's throne room, so uh, that's where I'm going. Tiny little problem. Boy, when these guys go, they go hard. Heavily inebriated. Doesn't mean they're not a threat. My best blade work happens after I've had a few. If a few scut knuckles gotta die to save Groot, so be it. Whoa, whoa. Hey, we are not here to start a war with the woman who's got her own private army. No, just rob her. If we do things right and be quiet, we'll be in and out with no one the wiser. Drax, what part of quiet don't you understand? Dead is quiet, Peter Quill. No killing! Don't touch anything, don't step on anything, and don't break anything. And don't do anything stupid. If we mess this up, it's game over for Groot. And us. Gotta hand it to the lady. She knows how to throw a party. It was like this with the Ravagers, too. Yondu 